Now, when we're talking about the greatest TV shows of 2016, one of my personal favorites that I did not get the hype for was Westworld. Uh, based on the original movie and as well as the story created by Michael Crichton, I wouldn't think Westworld would be something that I'd be interested in. You know, westerns, whatever, doesn't seem too cool. But I finally watched it, and this was one of those series that just got you hooked into wanting more and more and more. The performances were fantastic. Evan Rachel Wood did a great job. Thaddy Newton did a great job. Jeffrey Wright, James Martin, of course, Cyclops. Everybody doing such a fantastic job of keeping you enthralled. An idea of this maze, robots, sentient life, really good sci-fi brought to you in a nice little package of, of, of mystique and despair. This show had so many moments where you were just, oh my god, I, they kind of set it up for you and then you realize, I didn't see that coming. Oh shit, I didn't see that coming. And everything about it just feels so good. It's a very nice um, look at the, at the intricacies and the, the, the ethics and the philosophy of what is life, who are we? And Westworld does it with such a beautiful soundtrack. I love this show. Thank you so much, Westworld. This was an amazing way to really check out 2016. Now, besides HBO, Netflix was also able to create a modern classic sci-fi show. Now, Stranger Things is one of those shows that tries to pay homage to the 80s, a lot of 80s culture, um, but they succeed. Whereas other places don't because, you know, they do things tacky. Stranger Things produces a quality story with characters you really care about, with an amazing title sequence, as you can see, and a sound that is unique, retro, and the Duffer Brothers produce quality entertainment. This is one of those shows that I have to say is beautiful in so many different ways. It has so many different elements, and the atmosphere is electric, and everything about this is something you must check out. Another classic for 2016. And this is Chapter 2, The Weirdo on Maple Street. It's a great show. Check it out.